What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Whoa. We're in the wrong system here. L. I think it's an L. If you get the right letter. Alright, let's do it. We're doing it. YouTube, what's up? You are live. Good. I hope I am. That means it's working. Fragment Freedom Bro, what's up? Alright. Super NES Classic is coming out here. Just not too long from now. What's up, Neil? What's up, Joaquin? What up, 321 My Destiny? Did I pre order the SNES Classic? No, I did not. I did check into it and I saw on the Facebook group that like everyone was like, oh, it's at Walmart now. Oh, it's at Best Buy now. Oh, it's at uh, freaking GameStop. Oh, uh, Think Geek is selling it with, uh, you know, some figurines. So I was all up. You know, I was up to date, <laughs> kind of, <clears throat> what's it called, um, browsing the internets about all that. But no, I didn't. And, um, you know, I don't really, I w if I was to get it, I don't think I would open it. I would think I would just probably resell it. Just because I have the Raspberry Pi. Hair did. Yeah, it's kind of did. I need to, okay, that's how you pick up. Okay, cool. All right, I got the walk. I'm kind of cheating here, guys. I don't think I've ever beaten this game all the way through. I've gotten far. I don't think I got to the underworld, though. And I just remember really liking it. I know I need to go to the castle, right? The castle's northeast. It's a mess trying to get it, yeah. I thought it was up here. I guess I gotta go up here. Yeah, it's a real mess trying to get it. Like, Nintendo messed up big time. Oh, there we go. Gotta go up to the castle here. Um, and, I mean, look how good this emulates. Like, this is perfect. And I can save my state at any time. Uh-oh, we got a clue. All right, cool. Speed it up. My first time catching the stream, I sub recently have been binge watching your content. Great stuff. Fuber 2014, well welcome. Thanks for coming along to, on the journey. Uh, there's a lot of content there, man, so enjoy. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Most people in here are pretty cool dudes. 321 of my destiny, Fragment Freedom, Joaquin, all regulars, all nice dudes. Welcome. All right, we got a sword, nice. I give up on trying to get it. It's not even released and I'm throwing in the towel. That's right. I think if I stay, um, I think the idea is if I stay out of their range, they won't. Okay, so they take two hits. We got some magic. Oh, we got some, is it Ruples or Rubies? Ruples is Russian uh, thing. How's the sound, guys, by the way? I lowered the sound, system sound and I've given up trying to get it, not even release, and I'm throwing in the towel. Uh, yeah, I know. I feel you. I feel your pain, man. It's such a pain. Freaking Nintendo. Man, now I can't do that charge thing, huh? I think I could go in here, right? That's what I did with my NES Classic. Paid sixty dollars, had it sold for one seventy four before I got it home. Yeah, I mean at this point, it's um. So where do I go here, guys? I think I gotta go up. I don't know, we'll see very shortly. Sounds good, looks good. Thanks, guys. Oh man, there's two of them. 
Right, let's try here first. Can I move this? I remember you can like move this, right? Maybe not yet. Okay. Maybe I like this. Alright, so maybe this was the wrong direction. Should I go right or left? Your castle moved thy bush to fall in thy dungeon. Yes, indeedy. Do I have to light these? What if I light? I can't light those. I thought you could light that stuff up. Light it up. Kill him already. Alright. It's getting that money. Now we're doing it up or to the side. I feel like I should go to the side. What do you guys think? Has anybody seen Boss Keys? Uh, this the whole like short about the um, the dungeons and how they build dungeons. It goes over like whether they should be able to, um, you know, should you have to backtrack? Should you have to? Oh geez, am I supposed to be out here? Do I need anything out here, or am I wasting my time? Okay, that's a dead end. Slice the curtains. Was that I was supposed to slice the curtains back there, or can I keep going? Okay, that's locked. You haven't seen it, but I'm impressed. Which one are you talking about now? Did I already do this? Okay, now I can go down. I imagine there's something down here, like an artifact or the secret weapon I need, or a key. Okay, so I got the map, cool. Okay, cool, I got a key. I think if I move this, no? All right, so we got a key. We're on our way. Evidently, like, what was it, last week or yesterday or two days ago was the re was the anniversary of Zelda? Jesus, this guy's wrecking me, and he doesn't even know it. Get wrecked, dude. Get wrecked. Isn't there one level in the Zelda where you actually have to fall down to like go to the lower level? Isn't that one of the levels in this game? Alright, not sure where I gotta go here. Do we go up? Do we go down? Do we go all the way around? Dragon Freedom, I find it funny. Everyone wants the NES SNES Classic to play old games but we never have stopped love the pi 3 <laughs> now the n64 drops yeah exactly okay that was a freaking waste of time jesus yeah i mean people have been rocking that stuff for a long time now and all the same features like the only thing that might be a little different is is like the super graphics chip you know which is only for like two games gotta love the soundtrack so I guess I gotta go in this room because I don't have a key. This room I'll get a key and then... There we go. Finally, I got the boomerang now. And then I gotta equip the boomerang, right? Let's equip that bad boy. That's map. Okay, now I got the boomerang. What's up, Country Cletus? How you doing, man? Okay, I got a key too, so now I gotta go in here. What do you guys think? Do you think that you should have to backtrack 
in Zelda, or do you think like once you get the key, there's like a there's a gradual progress to it? Because that's a big argument about Zelda is like, should you have to backtrack? So what? Whoop! I was trying to throw my boomerang here. Oh, there's the princess. Let's get her. I think if I hit them, if I hit them with one of these, they die pretty good. Keep hitting the wrong key for boomerang. <laughs> Whoa. Oh! <laughs> oh, that was pretty bad. I should, probably should have saved my state there, huh, guys? See, that's just me playing my game. Not very good at it. Okay, so you can't go through doors while there are people there. Okay, here we go. Yeah, as far as what's up with me, man, just have enjoying the day. Got finished with some work, so decided I was gonna play some games. I found out that this game specifically, the original one for um, Nintendo had a 30 year birthday. Evidently it was like August something, 1986, was when the first Zelda came out. And uh, I've, be, I've gotten pretty far in the original NES Zelda to like where I feel like I'm not really missing out on much as far as like, whoa, 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 whoa. Um, where like this one, I remember I got fairly far in it, but I don't, um, I got pretty far in it, but I don't really remember it. And um, I watched Boss Keys and Boss Keys goes over all the different Zeldas up to the one in GameCube, I think, or maybe even after that, and you know, a lot of people say that this was kind of the one of the best ones because after this, Capcom, basically, from what I understand, Capcom was the ones that worked on this series after afterwards. See how much more careful I am now. Oh, so hit, and then he's kind of a mini boss, right? This guy, cool. Princess, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. I do need another heart, though. Let me get this first. Got my dollars, and now I got my girl. All right, let's save our state. All right, state has been saved. Ah, here we go. I just showed one of my buddies the Pi 3 Red Dredger Pi and it blew his mind. No, no, no. I know Capcom didn't make all the rest, but I know that Capcom made the ones for Game Boy. They also made one of the other ones. I believe they made the one for GameCube as well. If you watch the Boss Keys um, series, they also made one of the like, GameCube, I think. I didn't. I actually didn't hear what she wrote. We just have to get back to that main room, is that right, guys? Go back to the main room and then go to the, um, go up and through that curtain, right? I think so, yeah, cool. I like how she's invincible. Love that noise, though. Oh, I bet it's faster if I just go like this, huh? So this is the whole idea, like, should you have to backtrack or should you just have to go in all of them? I love playing Ages of Seasons. Yeah, I heard it's really good. That's the one that goes from night to dark, right? There's like one that goes night to dark and there's one that goes, um, has like different kind of realms. What kind of TV service do I use to watch TV? Uh, I really don't watch TV, I have Netflix. And then, uh, yeah, pretty much Netflix. That's what I rock, what do you guys rock? Comcast is crazy expensive. There's a secret passage in the throne, yeah, I remember, I remember. 
So that Thunderbird thing, I'm guessing, is until the end of the game, right? Like, if we, when you go on the roof, there's like a Thunderbird type thing break, locking the door. Help me push it to the left. Is that we should push it to the left or push it from the left? We're doing it. Yeah, Cody's really good as well. I don't use Cody that much, but, uh, what? Forgot about the mice. Oh, we definitely need that. We need to equip some stuff here. Hold on, hold on. No, 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 I don't want to do that. I want to click my... Whoa! This freaking mouse is going to kill me. I want to get to my items. How do I get to my items? Am I that... Oh, start. There we go. And that's map, and then that's how you use it. Alright, cool. We're gooch, we're gooch. Slight learning curve. Still learning. <laughs> I have Comcast for internet and TD. I get 250 down and 25 up. Yeah, I'm in a similar, um, in a similar, I get great speeds. But, um, you want to hear some, you want to hear a funny story? Our Comcast, um, had been charging us all year, guys all year for the last 12 months a rental fee on a router and we've always had our own router it's not like there's a router we forgot to return or anything it's that they were charging us for this router and it was like five or ten dollars a month but times 12 months that's like 60 or 100 it was like 120 i think oh, let's just say it was that much 120 dollars so we call them up we complain and you know you complain you complain you complain and then you finally get like a manager on the whoa, I need my knife out. <laughs> bats. I hate bats. Complain, complain, complain. And um, we finally find out that um, the manager's like, you know, when we've already talked to like three people, got transferred, all that stuff. You gotta do all that stuff because it's just BS like that. And then he's like, I can only take off three months. Can you believe that? We can only take off three months. That's all it allows me to do on the system. <laughs> Like, really? We don't own your router. We don't have your router. You guys are charging us for your router. And you can't refund our money that we never got service for. Awesome, Comcast. Awesome. Uh, but back on the whole thing about speed, yeah, it's definitely the fastest. That's just it. It's because our my only alternative is to go to AT&T. And AT&T doesn't have fiber here. I know AT&T does offer fiber in certain locations. And unfortunately, our location is not one. So my only other choice is either to get like a private line or go with DSL. And DSL, the regular DSL, is not that great. But uh, yeah, our Comcast is actually pretty fast. The thing that bothers us about Comcast is they try to sell you on the TV all the time, the TV services, and uh, their, the customer service is janky. Yeah, I wasn't supposed to notice that charge exactly. That's just it. Like, most people don't check. Like, mo I bet you most people in here have a lot of their bills on auto pay. You know? And, like, you just don't notice. You know? You go, whoa. You know? Once they're on auto pay, you don't see that stuff. At Drew Talk Showbox. What are you talking about, Tundra? Should I kill these? These guys might have keys. I should probably kill them, kill them right? Especially this guy. He's definitely a key mouse. It's 90. Yeah, we pay something like 99 a month without TV. And like we keep having to lock into a contract. See, like this is interesting to me. That's a bomb area, right? You can use a bomb here, but I have no bombs yet. So do I have to go back here once I get bombs in the game? And if so, is that even worthwhile? I know one of you guys know that answer. Don't hold that, don't hold it back on me. See, like, this is why this game is so great. It's because there's, like, puzzles like this to solve, right? Like, I can push up one or I can push over one. Such a great game. Ting is going to come here. Yeah, I heard Ting is pretty good, especially for cell phone services because it's kind of more of a pay what you need. I also heard that Verizon Vios, has anybody tried Vios? It's pretty decent. No Vios people? Vios people in the house?
I should probably save my state. Just in case something happens. Pull. What did she say? Which lever should I pull? I was not reading that, guys. Which... Good thing we have load state, right? I can just load my state and read the thing again. <laughs> okay, what she's... Sanctuary is just beyond that door. Pull the switch over there. Which switch? I don't think it really matters, does it? Oh, see, I pulled the punt line. It's not really bad. I mean, if anything, I make a bunch of money. Do I need money for anything? I think I need money for, like, a candle eventually, right? Or do I just get that in this game? You have to pull the lever. Yeah, I get that. It's pretty easy to do. Frontier for $45 a month. What's Frontier? What kind of service is that? Is that DSL? Uh, fiber? What's up, IT crowd, man? How's it going? Welcome, welcome. Frontier took over Fios. Oh, okay. Yeah, one gigabyte down. I'd take that any day. Yeah, you're in a different market. Up in the Bay Area, we got janky stuff. In the Bay Area, we do have something called Google Fiber, but Google Fiber was only rolled out in certain areas, like a lot in the South Bay in San Francisco, and that's not where I live, so. But Google Fiber is legit. I use Verizon, don't know what it's called. Yeah, Verizon's good. Decent, at least. And I don't know if you guys know this, but Verizon, as of... Uh, today they upgraded their unlimited plan so if you're using them for cell, cell phone service that upgraded as well all right i'm using this walkthrough guys because i have to okay eastern palace because i don't want to like spend too much time on this game you know i want to know where i'm going at least at this point lincoln journey straight to the eastern palace located at the east end of the overworld however there are tons of goodies to find beforehand upon exiting the sanctuary travel westward two screens to reach a building just north of the village So reach building just just north of the village from here, the Lost Woods. Okay, so it's saying, however, there are lots of goodies. Upon exiting the sanctuary, travel westward two screens. So never eat shredded wheat. So that's this way. And go over to the Lost Woods. Okay, I can handle that. Is this the Lost? Am I, am I correct here? Where am I? Guys, I need some help here. Am I doing this right? Did I not do this correctly? Let's go back to Zelda's rescue. Continue down the screen, you'll find two levers that exit the sanctuary to go back outside. That's what I freaking did. Okay, so we're out of the sanctuary. So this was the sanctuary here, right? Where was it? The screen here. At this point, Lincoln Journey is straight to the, the located east of the... Let's look at my map here. So where's the Lost Woods at? Well, that's blinking right there, so I should probably go there, right? Let's go to the blinking area. All right, back to the chat. Whoa, got to get back in this chat. Missed a couple things. My phone is faster net than my house. Wow, that's pretty sad. Sorry to hear that, man. Hold on, where am I now? You need money for swine apples. <laughs> I sure do. I need money for the flippers. All right, good thing. How much are the flippers at? The only thing you actually need rupees for other than picking up extra items or whatever, yeah. So I guess I need to talk to her. I read some story that the FCC has lowered their standards for high speed to town one up. Yeah, I'm sure they're... Pfft. All these cell phone companies and companies are freaking... You know, trying to make an extra dollar. Like with freaking Comcast. Like they charge us for a router that we never actually had. What is that? Liquor Snurf, man, it's going good. How about you? What's up, level one online? 
Okay, why is there still an X on this? And I guess, oh, I gotta go over the license. I guess I can go Lost Woods this way. Okay, there's a hole there. I'm trying to find some, I'm trying to, like, I can go in here. Like, I feel like there's a lot to explore here, guys. Is there fairies in here or something? Okay, so at one point I can get up there and get those. Okay, cool. Still a better love story than Twilight. 500, okay, I need to start collecting these then. Is this the Lost Forest up here? I hope so. Oh, I guess I could just jump down there and then get into those treasure chests, huh? All right, we got some bombs. So my question is back in the palace of Hyrule or wherever we were earlier, should I go back now that I have bombs? And if so, what do I get in those little bomb shelters? Or is that more for like the overworld? <laughs> Thanks, Matt, little pixel. Appreciate it, man. I don't mind stream jumpers. Actually, hmm. Just come in and say hey at least. I'd rather have you say hey than say nothing at all though, you know? But don't, don't, uh, just be honest. Say, hey, I'm not gonna stay long. <laughs> all right, is this the Lost Woods now? Okay, we're in the Lost Woods now. Is this right? Okay, cool. Ray Ray Gaming, what's up? How's it going? Welcome to the crew. All right, travel the, beware of the enemy crow that is perched on one of the nearby trees. Further north, you'll find a hut along the nine small bushes above. Slash your way to the middle bush to find a secret hole that you can fall down. Inside, collect the first piece of the heart. Okay, we can do that. I probably can switch to this now, right? So head north. Ooh, fairy. It says head north. Whoa, whoa, who's this guy? Get out of my kitchen. Oh, there's a sword. I guess I can't pull that sword out yet, though, huh? It says head north. Are these bad or? This mushroom smells sweet, rotten fruit. You can give this to whoever wants it. Awesome. I love mushrooms. Whoa, this guy just started moving on me. Oh, whoops, don't hit that. So go north, 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 north. Oh boy. For 100, I'll let you open one chest and keep the treasure that's inside. Here, let's save the state here. Save state. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Okay, that was a bad deal. Let's load our state. I wonder if this is random though. Is 300 the best we could do? That's pretty good, right? We got 300 rupees now. <laughs> Should we do that again just cause? So we have our money for the rest of the game. Okay, here, let's save it. Is your game titty clicker? <laughs> All right, let's save the game. All right, now we're good. <laughs> this is pretty good. <laughs> All right. Where are you going, little dude? All right, so it tells me to go north, guys. Like, how much more north can I go? All right, man. It's all good. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, we have another question here, sorry. <laughs> I'm cool with lurkers, gotta go. All right guys, later, la later, uh, who came in? I'm new to the crew, so I'm in. Ray Ray, what's up, man? Yeah, you're, wel you're welcome. What's up, Drew? I was just playing this couple days ago, Bobby. How far did you get, Bobby? So it says I need to go north. Oh, here we go. And there's a scarecrow. Oh, Jesus, what are all these animals? 
Okay, that's the sword. I don't think I can get that yet. Fragment Freedom, all right, man. So thanks for stopping by. Hey, y'all, hanging out till I have to leave for work in a few. Doesn't it feel good to be just about done with work? All right, it's telling me that if I go far north, I think maybe I went in the wrong woods. Come on, guys. You're supposed to know this stuff. Oh, he comes after me. Oh, I think this guy... Oh, he steals bombs. Okay. <laughs> My favorite game. All right, guys. We need, I need some help here. Because it's telling on this walkthrough, it's saying, at this point, Lincoln journeys straight to the Eastern Palace, located on the east end of the overworld. However, there are tons of goodies to find beforehand. Upon exiting the sanctuary, travel westward, two screens to reach a building just north of the village. From here, head north to enter the Lost Woods. I think I was in the right place. I think it's in this general direction. What the heck is that? Ah, here's the hole. All right, below the scarecrow, inside, first, okay. Oh, it's just a heart piece. Okay, we're gonna get this heart piece really quick. Cool. All right, All right. so we got the heart piece, cool. Uh, collecting four of these pieces will add to one full heart. Yeah, duh. From the thief's hut, travel northwest and you'll find a mushroom lying on the woods. Collect the mushroom, which you can later use to acquire some magic powder. Okay, did I talk to this guy? There's a, th that's all there is to do in the Lost Woods for now. Go ahead and exit the way entered. Beware of an enemy thief that wanders around as he'll try to bump into you and steal some of your goodies. Yeah, I saw that guy. Back outside, head south and enter Kakarika Village. Kakariko. Whoa, there's the thief. This freaking thief. All right. Back to chat. My favorite game. All right, dude. Thanks for stopping by, man. Hope all's good. Appreciate you. Oh man, I'm about to die. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Yeah, sure. We'll start at my house. All right. I'm fine with dying. All right, where are we at? Okay, so. Yeah, I need to go to that village. Where, where's that village at? I think I gotta go over there. I think it's faster to just avoid, especially if I have enough rupees and I have hearts. I think the best thing to do is just avoid people, right? Oh my god. Jacomo, what's up? I guess I can I go through here or is this gonna be a dead end? Yep. I'm done with the lost lost the um oh there's a lot of people protecting this area. Can I get through here? I think so, yeah. Whoa. Bombs away. Jesus. I'm trying to get to the city, wherever I think they told me to go. I think it's over here. Right? Right? I thought I saw a sign over here. This way. Well, I didn't want to do that little. I think I gotta go here, right?
Is this, why does it have an X? Oh, I gotta talk to somebody else in the village. I just jumped in, but don't you need to beat a few dungeons before you can get that Master Sword in the Lost World? Yeah, exactly. And I think I need to talk to somebody in this village first. Is it this person? I just ransacked your house. All right, let's check this out. Oh. This looks very complicated. Is there a way to get every single one of these? Do they move? Oh, they only move once. <laughs> All right, let's check this. That was not the link I'm looking for. All right. Back outside, hell, the, the, the first stop at the northeast corner of town, there's an entrance to a cave. Okay, I already did that. Inside the cave, open the four treasures in the list post to collect some bombs. And seven, if you look closely to the northern wall, there's a strange mark. This signal can be blown up using a bomb. Oh, got it. Go ahead and enter the building and head down the basement. There are four treasure chests, each each containing 20 rupees. Take acquire all 80. Push the blocks according to the image above. Jesus, this is complicated. Okay. Ah, uh, okay, I see what's happening here. So you gotta go there. There. There, there, there. Okay, we got that one. Hold on. Wow, this is really complicated. Can't I just do this? Oh, you can't do that. Oh, I think I messed up. Oh well, I don't need the rupees. I don't even know why I'm doing this. <laughs> um, oh, there's a place to bomb though over here that we need to do. Okay, then we gotta move along. Move along, move along. All right, so something we missed was over here. You gotta go in here, go back into here. Two hours late, Shauncey, what's up? All right, here's where we need the bomb. Nice, we got another piece of a heart. Smash that like button, yeah. What's not to like about Zelda, Link from the Past? We're waiting in line for this little SNES classic and we gotta recognize why we're getting it. Great games like this. All right. All right, cool. All right, we got that. Um, exit the house, go back to the hut. Oh, there's a there's another heart piece in here too that I missed. Check this one out. Got one more heart piece to get in here really quick. I don't really need the rupees. Nice. 
we're doing it. All right, next. Just south and west of the green hut, there's a merchant sitting on some carpet. The merchant will sell Link a magic bottle for 100 rupees. Link should easily have this by now, so go ahead and purchase a magic bottle. The next step in town is on the southwest corner where Link will find a small shack. The mysterious hut does not appear to have an entrance. That's fine. Let's do it. All right, we got that. Uh, mysterious hut, which is next step in town, southwest. So never each. Okay, so let's go southwest. So it's over here. Oh, I see. Oh, is this guy the scary guy? Yeah, was it really the scary guy? It says it doesn't seem to have an entrance, but I bet you it's here or something, right? Or inside? What are they saying? A mysterious hut does not appear on an Amazon, but Lincoln actually plays a bomb at its bottom wall to blow it up. Oh, okay. See, I don't think I ever played this. I don't think I ever found this before. All right, let's see what's going on in chat. Sorry. Yeah, that music did get intense. What? That wasn't much of a secret. All I got was a couple of bombs. All right. Uh, here we go. Next up and down to the south, they blow up. But inside, Link can replenish his bombs and arrows as well as acquire some rupees. Link can repeatedly re-enter this. Hook. Wow. Can you imagine? Look, you can re-enter and grab them all again. <laughs> How cheap is that? I'll just do it once. <laughs> All right. Let's save this. All right, next, what's up? Directly east of the mysterious hut. Directly east. Link will find the village shop. Just east of the shop of the Kronelian Inn, there's a secret back entrance to the bar that Link can access by simply walking the back of the building. Do so and open the treasure chest. Here's the bar, I'm guessing. Nice. Got another magic bottle. What's the chicken for? Dinner? All right, cool. From the back end of the bar, head into the building directly to the north. Speak to the bug catching kid. Okay, let's talk to the bug catching kid. Greatest game ever. You gotta wake him up. Okay, I don't think I really need arrows, it's fine. That's all there is to do in the main part of town, so go ahead and exit to the south. Here you'll find the house of books just south home go ahead and enter it use a bomb to blow down the wall to the left to reach the next room and then exit the building all right let's try it guys all right so what do we do here go ahead and enter it use a bomb to blow down the wall to the left Oh, whoops. I'm in the wrong house. They're showing a different house. Oh, it's this house. Yep. This is where I need to blow it. Okay. 
Here you'll find the 15 second game. Link has 15 seconds to journey through the maze and if he wins, he'll get the piece of heart that's waiting for him. Slash the first five bushes as you make your way northward. Take the path to the left and slash three more bushes. Run over to the sign and you can jump over the wooden plank just south from there. Walk over to the end of the maze and claim piece number heart. Jesus. Let's see if I can handle this. The 15 second game. If you can reach the goal within 15 seconds, we'll give you something good. Okay, so it's saying go up five, go to the left, take the path and slash three more bushes, run over to the sign and you can jump over the wooden plank. Just south from there. I did it! Yes! Nice! We're up a high we're up a heart, people! Nice. Yeah, Chrono Trigger was dope. Live chicken in the jug behind the bar that's not sanitary. <laughs> totally not. What's up, what's up? Yeah, I actually got pretty far in Chrono Trigger, that's why I'm not playing it. I've mean to play Chrono Trigger, da da da. Yeah, Chrono Trigger totally worth it. Totally, totally worth it. Uh, where are we now? Okay, so we got it. Cool. The next stop to trade the mushroom that Link acquired in the Lost Woods. Backtrack through the village and return to the sanctuary. Rock right two screens to the cemetery. Continue down this. Man, we got a lot of walking to do here, peeps. So I guess I can't get the book yet. Is that right? To go back through the. Oh man, how do I get back here? I can't get up there. So the library with the book, I can't get that yet. Is that right? So the cemetery, where's the cemetery? Next up, trade the mushroom that Link acquired. Backtrack through the village and return to the sanctuary. Walk right two screens through the cemetery. Continue down screen across the bridge and back to the screen. Walk right to the screen find at the magic shop. Where is that, guys? Is that... Is that here? That's his house. That's like a forest. Which is the sanctuary though. Let's see what's this right here. So what's on this side? Okay, so it's not that. All right, so we need to find the sanctuary. This could take some time. What's up with chat? I've been meaning to get SNES RPGs. I did pick up a few. Yeah, um, and supposedly a lot of people like, um, what's the game that a lot of people like? Um, not Chrono Trigger, there's another one. Oh, here's the sanctuary, I think. Okay, I think this is the sanctuary, right? So what's it saying? Uh, next up, which... So through the sanctuary, two screens, and then down a screen. All right, let's see if we can handle that. Continue down a stream across the bridge. Is there a bridge? Okay, there's the bridge. Crabs. Jesus. Okay. Um, magic shop up and to uh, over. Okay. So I think that's where we want to go. All right. Let's go to this magic shop. All right, I think I need to get magic powder. Ah, there we go. Okay, 
Okay. Continue down da, 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 back. We write to find yourself at the magic shop. Okay. There is a witch named Syrup who resides outside the shop. Uh, walk to the witch with the mushroom equipped and give it to her. You got it. She tells you to come back to the shop later for something good. After giving the mushroom to the witch, just walk left to screen and then return to the magic sh Okay. Easy enough. Final Fantasy VI is really good. What's the other one? It's like something... For Super Nintendo, what's the name? I know you guys are going to know the name. I thought, did you, did you give it to me? Did I not get it? Breath of Fire, Secret of Manor. No, no, no. I'm talking um, RPGs for the Super Nintendo. There was also um, Breath of Mana, I think is the name. There's one, and then there's another one as well. Okay, there's a witch named Serp. She tells you to come back. After giving the mushroom to the witch, just walk left screen and then return to the magic. This time, head inside. Oh, okay. You'll find the magic powder. Okay, I need to go inside. Go inside. Okay. Grab it with A. This item can be sprinkled on top of enemies or other items to cause some unique things to happen while inside the shop. It might be worth picking up a blue potion. Okay. All right, I'm doing whatever you tell me to. After getting the magic powder, Link is now ready to tackle the next dungeon, the Eastern Palace. Link can get two optional heart pieces as well as the ice, ice rod at this point in the game, but all these things are somewhat out of the way at the moment. The pieces of heart won't add to Link's overall health, and the ice rod has no practical uses in the first dungeon. Nevertheless, jump over to chapter three. Nevertheless, if you'd like to acquire these goodies right now. No, I don't really want to. Let's just kind of like to just go in a somewhat logical order. The lure sage within sanctuary marks your map, indicates you should travel to the village. Is that right? It's always been marked like that. Uh, the mark on the map corresponds to the village's elderly health. Upon arriving, you'll find the wife. Okay, so now I gotta go back to the village. Okay, now we can chat. We can chat it up on my way over while I'm, while I'm walking across the map here earthbound yeah there you go guys that's exactly what i was thinking about there's breath of wild there's earthbound um chrono trigger all really good i never got it i beat i got very far in chrono trigger i also got very far in mario rpg um but breath of the mana and and earthbound neither of those games i've gotten very far in but i understand they're awesome and i played a little bit of earthbound the other day and it was it was awesome just what happened was I was playing on a different image and then I um, no longer, <laughs> I wrote over that image and then all my save states were gone. So I kind of got a little discouraged on that one. So the answer to that is buy lots of micro SD cards. And while we're on the topic of micro SD cards, there's plenty in the description below. <laughs> okay. Secret of Mana. There you go. Breath of the Wild is Breath of the Wild. Oh, man. I have so many. You've, if you've watched these streams before, you know I get words wrong all the time. All right. Uh, including the, 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 the marks and map of the corresponding village. Elders. And upon arriving, you'll find Shakira's wife, but the elders nowhere to be found. Elsewhere in the village, you find Shahara, Shaharahala's grandson, who will mark Shahala on your map at the east end of the overworld. Speaking to Har will cause him to mark the location of the Eastern Palace on the map. None of this actually is actually required in Lincoln and said journey straight to the Eastern Palace. Are you serious? So should I find this kid to mark my map or should I just try to find it? I think I should just try to find it. Forget this kid. 
All right, it says go east two screens off from the sanctuary. So let's go back to the sanctuary here. So there's one screen. Am I doing this right, guys? East a screen and then down a screen. It says down a bridge. All right, I think I might find this kid because I don't know where the hell they're talking about. Unless some of you guys know where the Eastern Palace is at. Yeah, it is. It's just emulation. All right, so I need to find the kid. The kid. If I find the kid, the kid's going to tell me where it is on the map, right? It's a guy, though, I think. Oh, jeez, I'm gonna, like, die this freaking... I almost died to that guy. Are you freaking kidding me? So I need to find the little boy, right? Where's the little boy at? Okay, he's not in there. Do I have a PC I use for emulation too? I just use my regular computer and uh, I haven't really done much PC emulation, to be honest. Um, just because I have the Pi and like, unless I'm gonna play Nintendo 64. The cool thing about PC emulation though is you can play um, net play. So potentially you can play against other people, which is kind of cool via the network. You can on the Pi too, supposedly, but it just seems a lot harder. All right, where's this kid? Where's this kid's parents at, man? But the elder know where to find. Elsewhere in the village, you'll find the grandson who will mark. Yeah, but where? Where in the village is his grandson? Okay, here we go. Oh, there's a little location here. All right, this is it. Where's this kid at? Is he in the tavern? Getting drunk? No. The grandson. Maybe that was one of the grandsons. He's just a lot older grandson. Okay, I don't care about your grandson. All right, that didn't help very much. Yeah, I made a video about Nintendo 64 and you, oh, there he is. This is the kid, I bet. There he is, we got him. All right, he marked it on our map now. All right, so where are we going? Ah, okay, so I gotta go. Ah, I gotta go back to the spell place and then down the bridge instead. Okay, that's easy easy to do. Pi net play is currently meh. Yeah, I haven't done it myself. I've heard that it's not very good from others. I have no experience. Isn't the palace in the lower left corner? No, Jason, it seems like it's in the east middle kind of area. But thanks for the trying, man. Appreciate it. I wish my friends were into emulation so I had someone to try net play with on the Pi. Maybe you should find, become friends with somebody in chat here. Alberto, what's up, man? How's it going? Happy Wednesday, hump day. It was hump day. Was I able to pre-order the NES Classic? No, and I wasn't really trying to I, I, either. I know a lot of other people were trying. Um, I was just telling the stream that I would just do it to get to resell it because I already look like look. I'm already playing these games. Like, I have no, I have no point to. Um, you know, to do it, to like, I have everything I need already. I would just be buying it as like a collector's item. It 
So there's an enemy here, feel free to kill him, but otherwise, travel. Oh, whoa, that guy almost got me. Aye, aye, aye. These mechanics. Uh, so I gotta go all the way down and then back up. Alright, let's check on that the live chat here. I've got two monitors, but one monitor is reading the walkthrough. Man, I'm almost dead. This guy's gonna gotta give me some freaking health. Stop giving me money. I think if you hit these, they attack you, right? Oh, geez, get away from me. <laughs> okay, I think we're in the Eastern Palace now. Wrong spot, sorry. Oh, who the heck is this? I'm D's, uh, the village elder in this. Zelda ever. Thanks, man. Do I only get to select one here or what? Nice. I gotta have bombs. Nice. The maximum rupees you can have is 9999, right? Yeah, I love trying all these old school games. I recently bought an Atari 26 and an original NES Pong and some other stuff. 70 bucks. I'm loving it. Nice, dude. That's a score. Where's the um, palace at? Oh shit, it's over there. I guess I can jump down then. This whole thing is a freaking maze. Oh, I see what's going on here. I gotta kill these guys. Do they die? Okay. Later. I think we're just about there. All right, we made it into the dungeon, guys. We're in the dungeon. If you need to go to sleep, play Pong. Damn. I think it all depends on like what you grew up with, you know? All right, let's do the walkthrough. I don't want to spend like days and days in here. Okay, lift the pot that is straight ahead and step on the switch to open the door. The enemy Popo found here can be defeated with a simple sword slash and a good source of rupees. Step on the ground switch to continue in the next room. All right, let's do it, people. Yes, I'm using SNES 9X. They're like, oh, kill these enemies. They're a good source of rupees. They gave me Jack. Jack. I didn't get anything. Okay, in this room there's a series of balls that are shot towards Link, including a giant ball that takes up the full width of the narrow passage. Travel through carefully using the sides to protect yourself from the balls. Once you make it across, turn to the left. Oh, I gotta get it across here, huh? Hey, oh. Got it. Go to the left. Once you get across, go to the left. And follow the passage up the stairs and across a bridge. Go to the left. Oh, I gotta go like. There we go, across the ridge, got it. Open it and get 100 rupees. Backtrack to the north end of the room and continue up the stairs and up the screen. Okay. So that was just a little detour there, guys, to get us more rupees. Pong is table tennis. Yeah, some people take table tennis really seriously. Okay, I should probably be reading what they want me to do. Check out my channel. <laughs> okay. Um, 
The pathway to the right is completely optional and will lead Link to acquiring a dungeon map. Okay, let's skip that. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna stop using the walkthrough for now. Just see what's up here. A CRT screen is like a hard glass material and heavy, also known as a tube TV. Yeah. Get wrecked, right, kid. All right, well, we have the compass, but no map. Great. Yeah, they, they, they look pretty good. You can use the treasure hidden in this palace to defeat armored foe. Okay. See, this is where I'm not sure. Do I go right or do I go down? I know this guy can defeat. I gotta hit his eye, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay, I need the dungeon key for this. Push up and down, bro? No. I don't think it's on the stream, bro. I don't think anyone can see it. Oh, that's a big dog. This is current start? Yeah, dude, they loved it. A little sneak peek, a little doge action. Oh, jeez. You missed it? Okay, I got a key. I'm a little confused though, are you guys? I think I had to go down first, what do you guys think? Nice dog, my dog is in a cone right now. Oh shoot, I can get in there, okay, that's good. Okay, now I'm back here. I remember this. I think I need the special key for this, right? I don't think I'm ready for this. I think I should have gone left back there. God dang it. The dog's getting some game time for sure. Oh geez, now I gotta hit this freaking thing first. All right, I think I was supposed to go back there, guys. I think in this room, or this room back there, I need to go down first. This is where I made the wrong turn, not here. Jesus, how many rooms did I go through? This one. What's up? Rate it? Oh, I thought I could. Huh. Am I doing something wrong here, guys? Yeah, Shanti, your avatar is a doge. But see, that's a doge. It's not a dog, it's a doge. Am I doing something wrong here, peeps? 
Have we played Link Between the Worlds? No, I haven't played that one. Is it good? Ah, okay. I needed gunpowder over there. Got it. That's what I was supposed to do, guys. All right, we're good. We're good. We know what we're doing now. We need to use our gunpowder. Powder now. We're doing it. We're doing it little by little. Oh, it's an updated version of this game on 3DS. Oh, same exact um, enemies and everything. Okay, so here's where I need to use the gunpowder, I think. Is that. So that's where I had to use it. I might. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Oh, whoops. I guess they're not. I guess I don't need that. I think it's saying they're in here. I thought those things were the ones that needed the magic dust. But we gotta go back in here to where those two little glowing things are, the dark room. Oh, shoot, I thought I was gonna die. saying go in here and then go down it's saying go down what? it says there are a pair of enemy igors here but they are best avoided from now just run right through the room and exit to the right climb the steps and head down a screen to reach a dark chamber. Dude, guys. I got it. I got it. So I was doing it right. They're saying these guys can be defeated with this. Nice. I probably could have caught one. Alright, so we got that. So what we need to do is we need to go back into this room. And we have to kill these guys first. So let's get a boomerang out. guy got him there we go now we got our magic powder now we got our big key all right all right we're we're moving now we're rocking we're rolling oh whoa whoa whoa, whoa. these guys are gonna kill me all right cool Ah, okay, now we can go back here. It's a shortcut back here. All right, we're cool, we're cool, we're cool. Yes, we got the bow. Oh, shoot. What? Why are these heads coming at me? What's up? We're gonna have to flex on some nerds. Tell them. That's you got cool, this, bro. bro? Got him, bro? I'm, I'm gonna try it. I'm Twitch TV, gonna... got it, bro? You gotta plug my stream, bro. Are you gonna stream?
Man, it takes a while to cock that bow. There we go. Who's this guy? Got them, bro. You got them, bro. Alright, now I'm not sure where I go, though. Do I go right or to the left? Oh, shoot. It always... Okay. Sure. I'll take some of that. Be good. I'll take that. Some people weren't impressed. Can I kill these guys with the bow? I don't think so. Can't kill them much. Jesus. Oh, Jesus, gonna be fun. Look at that, easy peasy. Look at those jukes. Man, they don't even know. It's like Michael Jackson moonwalking. Look at that. Easy. Easy. Oh, we got the boss here, right? Oh, 30 is max bows? I would have had like 60 bows by now. Or arrows. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I just wasted hella bows. I'm gonna go reload my state here. Got him. Woo! Sweet. Da -da -da, get that, kill that, do the balling balls. I think I did all right. After the final item defeated, collect the heart container to increase your health to six hearts. That's right, I got six. And you'll be transported outside of the dungeon. Thank God, I don't have to walk back through that thing. Cool. And now we're on chapter three, Desert Palace. Now that Link has the pendant of Kurds, the first stop is to visit right here within the Eastern Palace compound can be found in a small hut. Oh, I remember where he was at. Actually, I think I can go here and make it a little faster later. Later. If I remember right, he's like up here or something. Oh, he's down here. All right, visit this guy. Speak with him and he will give you the Pegasus shoes. Cool. Sweet. These shoes will give Link the ability to dash. There's a crack wall within the hut resides for those particular types of crack walls. Link can either blow them up with a bomb or dash into them with the Pegasus shoes. Nice. He has now marked two places on the map for you. The pendant and power is located within the Desert Palace at the southwest corner. 
However, Link will need to acquire the Book of Medora to enter the palace. The Book of Medora can be found within the southern portion. Oh, uh, now I gotta go get that. Okay. All right, we got some walking to do. Let's chat it up, guys. How you guys doing? Uh, Cloud ZNES on the Pi or PC? I don't know. I haven't used either. Or ZNES, yeah. This is the... I think it's a ZNES or SNES 9X is the emulator. Let me just jump down. Damn, he's a savage. There's some pretty good Zelda hacks. Oh, like actual game hacks. Let's see if I can go anywhere else. I guess the fastest way is just to go straight up, huh? I forgot I can dash now. Look at that. Boom. Let's we'll go across screens. Can I go swimming? Oh, whoops. <laughs> Can't do that. Yet. Once I reach 100 subs, I'll be doing a 320. Dude, try not to advertise too much in this channel, man. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I'm gonna get that book. So the book is on the bottom of the town. I just bought my son a pie a year or two ago. Stopped going to his friend's house playing now. He wouldn't go out, lol. Yeah, I mean, the pie has so many games. You can be occupied for hours. I mean, look at this game. Whoops. Yeah, the 9X is the best option. They said they just updated like the regular SNES. Um, you know, and now it could support like uh, high definition audio files and things like that. But for compatibility and runnability and all that stuff, I would have to say, um, nice. We got the book. All right, so we got the book. Now what? Okay, Lincoln, uh, Pegasus is dashing the bookshelf causing to fall. At this point, Lincoln journey directly to the desert or take on the next dungeon. However, there are several optional goodies to collect in the overworld. The first of which is the way back by the sanctuary immediately to the west of the sanctuary. There's a higher ledge with a pile of rocks. These rocks can be broken. Okay, so. So where are we going? We're going to go to the sanctuary. There's a higher ledge with a pile of rocks. By, and all the way back in the sanctuary. Okay. There's a pile immediately west. There's a higher ledge. Okay, so let's go back to the sanctuary and then we're gonna go to the west. I would really prefer if you would be quiet. Who, who are you talking to? <laughs> it's my stream, man. I would really, who, who puppet? Who puppet? Dang memes. My son Shanti has been watching you. Oh, right on. Shanti's a cool dude. He's in here often. Whoa, don't need to go there. Okay, so I have to go through the sanctuary, right? So I gotta go through the entrance. Is this the sanctuary here? I'm not sure if this is correct or not. Is this considered the sanctuary? That's what I'm confused about. Jesus. Jesus. Die already. Okay, so here's the sanctuary. Is this the sanctuary? Or is this the I don't think this is right. Yeah, stop talking. <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna come to your channel and just tell you to shut up. All right, at this point, uh, there are several optional goodies to collect. The first of which is all the way back by the sanctuary immediately to the west of the sink. Oh, west, okay, so that's on the other side. Oh, I think there's a hole here. What does this do? Oh, look at that, I'm all healed up. 
Nice. Oh, okay, that makes sense. So there's a fairy over here. Cool, cool stuff. All right, so to the west of the sanctuary. This is the sanctuary, right? So it's right up here. Or that, that's the sanctuary, is the actual building. All right, guys, I need some help here. Oh, I think it's up there. What do you guys think? I think it's up here. Oh, Jesus. Caught me mid-charge, mid-dash. Oh, shoot. Get off my kitchen. All right, here we go. So directly west, there's a pile of rocks. I'm guessing it's up here. doing this right mmm there's a heart piece there so that looks pretty promising oh it's up on the ledge I see now I see where it is all right back in the chat <laughs> Okay, thanks, man. Low pixel. All right, see this. You're the first one that's actually like helping me out here. But I think basically it's over here. Okay, no, it's not there. Down here. All right, here it is. So this is where we need to be. No, no, it's saying you can get this one. Um. I think it's this. Yeah, see? Boom. This is what it was trying to have me do. Go into here. Boom! We got it. That's what we we're trying to get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Good, good, good. Ram it. All right. Cool. So now, um, the next destination is at the south end of the overworld. Make your way over to Link's house and from there head south. Okay, so his house. That's his house right there, right? Oh, no. That's his house. So we gotta go around the dungeon. Or I guess we go down and then across to the dungeon. Okay, cool. Look at those jukes. Is this right? Yeah, we can go down and then to the right. Link's house. Okay, there's his house. All right, we're going to his house. Oh, nice. Yeah, just die and then you'll end up in Link's house. Okay, go south, southern end. Okay, go to Link's house and then. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! I wasn't ready for you, bro. Come on. There we go. I need some health now. Okay. Okay, uh, make over to Link's house and from there head south to enter the Great Swamp. Okay, I can sure use some of them. Link will find a building known as the Swamp Ruins. These ruins become very important later on in the quest, but for now they are only useful to obtain a piece of heart. Where's my swamp ruins at, peeps? Oh, there they are. Is that them? Where's my swamp ruins at? Oh, there they are. I see them. Gotta go a little more south. These are the swamp ruins. I imagine there's gotta be like all sorts of goodies in these grass. There's Jack. I've got freaking one rupee and an enemy. Okay. Alright. 
Okay, so here... This seems complicated. <laughs> Which one do I hit? Oh. The southern end of the Great Swamp, the refined swamp ruins. The ruins become very important later, but never now either you see you obtain a bomb. Inside the swamp ruins, Link can push the blocks out into a gator to contain some bombs. If Link re-enters the ruins, the blocks reset, allowing him to progress to the next room. Okay, let's re-enter. Alright, now what do I do? I guess I can go like this, and then go like that. Nice. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. At this room, pull the right lever. Right, enter the ruins and you'll find the heart piece. In addition, there's also a pair of fish. Strangely, Link can pick up one of these fish and bring it all the way to the bottle merchant in the village. The merchant will reward Link by giving him some rubies, bombs, arrows, and a large magic jar. Do I have to catch it with my net? Do I, how do I get this fish? No, I didn't! I lost the fish! So I gotta do this again to get my freaking fish? God dang it. I need my fish. How do I get the fish, guys? Yeah, you gotta shrink those images, man. You gotta make sure they get the 32, 64 limits. So how do I get this fish, guys? Do I need to get a bottle out? Like, how do... You get them with a the bottle? Where's the other fish at? How do I get this fish? Maybe this fish? Maybe I use the bottle on this one? Okay, what, what's the... <laughs> Exit the ruins and you'll find a piece of heart. In addition to this, there's also a pair of fish. Strangely, Link can pick up one of these fish and it'll go and bring it to the... Okay. I, I, is this real life? I'm trying to pick up the fish. They're not being picked up. You can pick it up. How do you pick up a fish? I'm about to die trying to pick up fish. All right, I'm just gonna screw that bottle for now. All right, what's next? From the swamp ruins, travel east two screens to reach lake. Right when you enter the screen, walk to the north and you'll find a crack on the wall. Place a bomb there. Okay. So the east. Okay. I'm about to die. What? Oh, oh. I'm gonna save my game really quick. Because I really am gonna die here. I think this is where they said they can bomb. Jesus. Oh. 
Good thing I saved my state. Are you... <laughs> Gotta watch for that backfire. Thank God there's safe state in this game, right? Alright, let's blow this up and then save it so we don't have to ever do that again. <laughs> SNES exclusive! There we go. Oh jeez, what's this guy? What's my deal here? Oh, he's gonna give me 300 rupees? I think I'm maxed out. SNES exclusive. All right, where do I got to go next here? Back outside, continue heading eastward towards when you reach this turn. When you reach the southeast corner, turn northward and continue to follow the path until you reach a cave. Walk inside and then place a bomb against it. Okay, here we go. <laughs> okay, let's uh, make sure we're loading, not saving our state. I'm actually going to save our, our state to another one. Alright, just in case we get... Oh, is that a fairy? Is that... What? Oh, that's bad. Alright, we're almost there. Give me a heart already. How about Irving Thomas trade? NBA stream memories all day, every day. I think that guy explodes, right? Oh, Jesus. Oh, jeez. Go all the way northward and then go southward. Jesus, these guys are so freaking slimy. All right, all the way northward, then. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, I thought I was dead there. Oh, there's a cave. Here's my cave that's gonna give me a, something. All right, we're in the cave, people. We just need to blow a bomb in here. I hate Zelda. Why do you have it? hate is such a strong word, duck scope? Oh shoot, I think I can capture one of these, right? Got one. I can put one in a bottle, right? Can't I do that? I guess not. Alright, now what I'm supposed to do here. This is like some secret that I need to know what to do. Continue up screen and open the. Wait a second. How do I do this? Oh, you gotta bomb this, huh? Oh, this one right here. There we go. Got it. We got the ice rod. All right. Once you head there, there's only one more goodie to collect before entering the deadest path. Luckily, it's right next to the dungeon. Travel back to the Great Swamp and make your way southwest corner of the overworld entering the desert. Okay, cool. 
we can do that. We can talk while we're doing that. What's up, guys? I hate Zelda. Y'all need to get some Game Genie action. Is there any Game Genies for the um, for Zelda? What is it, like, unlimited health? The dude's about to explode. Right through. I believe it's this way, right? Should I talk to this guy? Okay, I guess not. I need some milk? Why do I need milk? Something to drink? I got water, man. Alright, there's only one more goodie to collect before entering the de desert palace. Luckily, da da da. At the top right corner of the desert, there's a cave that Link can enter. I'm not in the desert yet, though. There we go. The top right corner, there's a cave, and then we can enter. In the second room, there's a crack along the southern wall. Okay, let's go to the second room. All right, this is it. Last heart piece before we gotta go into the palace. Another dungeon, guys. Dungeons and Dragons. Oh, I missed it lifting the... All right, where's our palace? Okay, there it is. There's an amulet. Jesus. So I think I need the book here, right? Oh, things are about to get real. What's up, Retro Junkie? How's it going, man? How you been? Once you acquired the Book of Medora da, 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 from the south portion, head over to the desert, one of which is Link's Pass. Walk up the stone block to the center of the area and use the book. Link will sing a song, causing three statues to move, opening an entrance to the desert. Blah, blah, desert Palace. Desert Palace has a number of completely optional rooms. The guide will just cover the quickest route through the dungeon. In the first room, there are a series of levers, as well as demos that will shoot out a laser beam towards Link. Make your way towards the Beemos and then take the pathway to the left. Not the Beemos. I think this is the pathway to the left. What the heck is this? Jesus. Pathway to the left. Okay, kill this guy. A red deviant blocks your path. Deliver two sword slices and kill him. Did it already. Continue left on the screen and then head up through the open door. Okay, let's continue left and head up through the door. A small key can be found on the top left part of the screen. Okay, we just got it. All right. Much like da, 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 collect it and then exit the room. Dash right. Two screens. Whoa. Oh. Can't really dash when I'm getting dying. One screen and then two screens. Dash two screens. Use a small key in the locked door and head on through. Can you 
use health, man. You got some health. Okay, then go down a screen. Use the key here, I'm guessing. What's going on? What's going on? Jesus, I'm missing all of Good Tom Hanks movie. If you've never seen, check it out. Mazes and Monsters. I don't think I ever checked it out. How many number one picks have the Cavs traded away then? Uh, I think they're doing Irving, right? Is he going to be traded or not? Dang, you did beat him. <laughs> Looks like there's drama in the retro community. All right. There are, there are Walters on the sides of the room that will shoot balls out towards the link. Avoid the balls and collect the big key from the treasure chest in the room. Okay, that's easy enough. All right. This room has a series. Oh, I got to go back over here. Go back to the main train and go up a screen and then left two screens, I think. One, two. Okay. Okay, now we gotta go in this room over here. Jesus. Lots of goodies in this room, it says. Well, this is blocked. Oh, okay, that does not block you from the guy. Good to know. Cool. Okay, we got this. What are the glove? You got the power glove. You can feel the strength in your hand. You can pick up and carry stones now. That's pretty sick. In this room, da, 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 get the power. There's a lot of love. Go back down a screen and right a screen. Okay, down and right. Yeah, almost at 10k, man. Okay, now where am I supposed to go? So we go left a screen. 31 people away from 10k. What should I do for 10k, guys? Continue down a screen and left a screen. Oh, did I miss this? So I got the power glove. Go back down a screen and right a screen. Okay, continue down a screen and left a screen. Okay, now we got down and left. Oh, I, I gotta kill this guy. <laughs> Jesus, some of these enemies are just painfully hard to kill. Jesus, I'm getting wrecked over here. Okay, here we go. Now we got this screen. Oh, so just continue down. I guess I don't need to be in there. Exit the first half of the dungeon south to get go back outside. While outside, walk southward along the left side of the ledge and you'll be able to get the piece of a heart. Okay, here we go. Nice. I guess I gotta go back in now, right? Now run to the north end of the desert. There's another entrance that's blocked up by some rocks, and now you can now lift these rocks. Cool. Ah. Get wrecked, kid. Cool. We're back in it. We're back in it. LOL and haven't posted a single video. It's all right, man. When the time's ready, you're ready. The last two weeks at work have sucked. We need some flipping non-staff happening days. <laughs> Sorry, dude. I know jobs can be... Uh... Okay, now what do I do in this screen, though? Do they want to see the dog? I'll let you know, bro. If they want to see the dog. Oh, we got it. Nice. Let's see if I can figure this out for the rest of the... I remember this. These tiles are freaking crazy. I think you can cancel them out though. Oh, do they just keep coming at you no matter what? Until there's like no more tiles left. Hey-oh. 
Do they eventually stop? Oh, they just keep coming. If you want to get, if you want to get a free case, you can be a Patreon supporter. So what I did was like, I have a bunch of extra pie cases, and so what I'm doing is for every dollar you support me on Patreon, you get like one raffle ticket for that. And I have to tell you right now, there's not many people in that raffle. Your chances right now are one in six. Whoa. This is not good. Probably should have waited till I had a lot more health. Jesus. Alright, I need a lot of health. Can I get some health over here? Oh, great. Another freaking tile. Get wrecked by the tile screen. Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna reload my state because I think I could have done a lot better there, like not get hit at all, especially since there's no health. Let's reload that. We can do it. We can do it without getting hit, guys. Yes, we did it. <laughs> okay. Cheater! Oh, I'm cheating hardcore here. You should know that. Oh shoot, you can't kill the guy with the. Ooh, this is one of those secrets you're like, it's a dead end, but I have a lantern. Nice. Twenty nine, twenty eight. Oh, am I getting subscribers? You on my live subscriber count? What do I need for this guy? What do I need? Do I need a uh, arrow? I don't even know what the boss this is. Oh, this is that like worm thing, right? Should I hit this guy with my sword or? Whoa, that was good. How are these guys hitting me? How are they hitting me when I'm like avoiding them really well? Am I doing this right or not? Come on, peeps. Come at me. Am I doing this right or should I be using my bone arrow? Oh, bombs? Okay. There we go. Got him. Twenty three. Man, I guess it's going pretty fast. Oh, you guys are like adding your second and third accounts. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Oh, you guys want to <laughs> my two hour ten K ten thousand subscriber? I don't know if you guys follow Jake Paul, but like he got to 10 million subscribers and they also, um, he's now down to 9 million because a bunch of people subscribe just to watch him like get unsubscribed <laughs> to get all happy and then to be like, oh man. So yeah. All right, cool. 
there's a trio, there's another thing, kill the boss, light it up. Okay, I did it without a tutorial. After the final item is defeated, collect the full heart and increase your health to eight. Here, grab the pendant of power. Did I grab the pendant of power? Did I not grab the pendant? Did I grab, <laughs> did I miss the pendant, guys? I don't remember grabbing it. Do I have it, guys? Am I like tripping? Can we rewind the stream and see if I got it? Did I get the amulet? Give out some dope prizes? Why are you gonna get, shouldn't you guys give me prizes? Like, come on. <laughs> Oh, I am tripping, I got it. Oh, I got it, okay. Jesus, man. I just remember picking up the heart and I was like, what, did I get it? Yo, Papa Linus, what's up, man? How you, how you been? You in here, you're on the Facebook group. You're like, oh, Mad Little Pixel posted. I think I'll come in and jam a little bit. True. We need you to give out the following for 10 cake subs. 10 pre-orders of the SNES Classic. 10 builds of the Raspberry Pi 3 with a 256 gigabyte micro SD card. Oh, and while you're at it, maybe a couple 8 bit arcade sticks. You know, why not? All right, cool. We're on chapter three, four. Chapter four, guys. Good, good on us. Now that Link has acquired the Power Glove, there are several new goodies for us to collect, including a pair of heart pieces and Zora's flippers. You'll need to have acquired 500 rupees to order the purchase of flippers, so if you haven't found all the secret rubies, be sure to check. Da -da 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 -da. First, we want to exit the desert to the southeast and then continue all the way back to Link's house. Are you kidding me? So we could just die, right? And go back to Link's house. Can't we do that if we just die? Let me save it really quick, just in case this is a bad idea. We go back to Link's house, right? Nice. I don't think there's anything wrong with what I just did there, right? Let's change the save state just in case. All right, cool. My cat hat, no, I can't give that away. That's a signature shit right there. Sign that up, put it on eBay for a fundraiser. From Link's house, head east and then north. East, north, I think this is it. Is this where I'm going? Head east and north. Jesus, what's this dude all up in my face for? Okay, head east and then north across the bridge. Where's the bridge at? Am I missing the bridge? Head east and then north across the bridge. Oh, I went the wrong way, I went west. I don't know what the heck I was smoking. Head east. And then north. Is this north here? Okay, that's not it. I don't think there's a bridge here. East and then north. I think it's that bridge there. Towards the desert. You think it's east like here? East, okay, and then north. Across the bridge. So head east and then north across the bridge. Continue walking north for two more screens and then head east to reach the potion shop once again. Oh, the potion shop. Okay, I know remember that is. Hey Drew, what's going on? Not much, man. Just hanging out, playing some Zelda. I don't think I'm gonna build, beat it all in this one sitting. But I definitely want to get some uh, some progress on here. I think this is what I got to do. Nice. I think I can also pick this up too, right? I 
happening. This is what I'm supposed to do. Head towards the point there's a large boulder that Link can now pick up. Toss it out of the way and then head eastward. All right, let's do that. Use the Pegasus shoes. Claim the bat, defeat the void, all the buzz blobs, and head up along the right side. Entering Zora's waterfall. Is this where I need to be? Oh. Oh. Is it up here? Is this where I'm going? Is this right? I feel like this isn't right. How far up do I need to go? Okay, they're saying go northwest. We're gonna go northwest, people. Ah, oh, Jesus. Is this right? I don't think this is right. Did I download the latest Duncan's? Yes, I did. I checked it out. And there's no ROMs. It's a, um, it's a, um, it's got like one or two, it's got one game per system. The only thing that it's done is he has a the splash screen. It's overclocked already for you. And it's got some like themes and collection stuff all set up for you. I think, was that right? Oh, okay, this is the waterfall? Atom bomb, yeah, that one. 18. All right, what do we got? Oh, I was going the right way the whole time. Jesus. Okay, so this was the correct way. I think I can just load my state. I don't want to load it and then be hella far away, so... Here we go, here we go. Shouldn't take me long. Look at these jukes. Oh. The jukes aren't working so well. Okay, so I gotta go up here and take the southern portion. Am I going to disrobe at 10k? I don't know, should I? What do you guys think? Take the southern one. I think that's this one, right? The southern route. This is some maze. This is some freaking maze stuff right here. Oh, we did it. All right. Once you start heading north, take the south west. Make your way to the northeast corner wall, and you will meet King Zora. Ask him for some flippers, and he will offer to sell them to you. Flippers. Now we can go in deep water. Go directly southward to find a waterfall. Swim towards it to the and jump down the lower area. Walk down and to the left to find an area of land. Keep walking over and collect a piece of heart. Oh, okay, I saw that earlier. So you were saying, oh, it's funny that ETA Prime has 60,000 subs and only has 5,000 to 4,000. Yeah, it's all part of the YouTube algorithm. I mean, that's why if you watch my video about, um, you know, getting, getting, being successful on YouTube, you know, it doesn't necessarily mean, it doesn't, like, subs aren't a measure. A lot of people think subs are a measure of how successful you are. But uh, you can have, like, no subs and just create a nice video. And if it gets the right kind of attention, you can still get a half a million, if not a million hits. But the video's got to be freaking amazing. Walk to the left screen, you'll find a waterfall. Hop into the water and swim into the waterfall to find a secret cave. 
Jump down another waterfall and exit Zora's waterfall. Okay. okay. Exit and exit Zora's waterfall is southwest portion of the screen. Okay. Walk to the left of the screen and you'll find a waterfall. I found a secret cave. Inside Link will find a mysterious pond where you can throw certain objects into the water. After throwing in an item, a fairy will appear. Dude, did I just give my... Oh, I thought I lost my bow. I was like, what? Some pepperoni nips. <laughs> I'll get my swine out out and we can get some. Uh... Don't do it. Okay, cool. 15 to go. Oh, I can I can pass my boomerang in there and get the magic boomerang. Okay, is it this boomerang? Okay, let's try this. Oh, didn't want to do that. I want to throw my boomerang in there. I got I guess I gotta. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Some triple X stuff with the pine with the swine apple. Does triple X like swine apples? Jesus! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> okay, I, I'm gonna save my state the next time I do this. I'm trying to scroll and give her my boomerang so I can upgrade my boomerang. I'm gonna save my state right here. So I can't. It's a good thing I saved my state, right? Here we go. I will give you something better in return. Nice. You can also throw your fighter shield. I don't think I have a fighter shield yet, though. Okay. Just south of the mysterious pond, Link will find one of Zora's waterfalls located in the water. This portal looks like a mark where it will pop out. I think I gotta go in here. Oh, cool. After going through the Whirlpool Waterfall, swim northward to a small island within the lake. Okay, let's try this island. Oh, is it right here? Enter the cave, here you'll find yourself at the Pond of Happiness. At the north end of this cave, Link will find a pond and he walks into it. He will be given the option to toss rupees in the pond. Initially, Link can throw either 5 or 20. After tossing in some rupees, you can walk a few steps away from the pond and then walk back to toss more rupees. Repeatedly throw rupees in the pond until you have thrown 100 rupees in total. Venus, the Queen of Fairies, will appear asking Link if he'd like to carry more bombs and arrows. Okay, here, how do we do this? Okay, throw a few. Is 
says you don't have to walk all the way away. Okay, here we go. I gotta do 100. Oh, that was slow. Slide hustle all day? Man, don't, don't, don't get, uh, don't get into lottery, man. My lottery story is that I, I used, when I was a waiter in a restaurant, like I would play every week because I was just always waiting for that, my break, you know, I was just like bartending and waiting tables and like, you know, trying to, you know, get a little extra money. And, uh, you know, a lot of people that win the lottery still like commit suicide and stuff like that. Because, I mean, you know, it's not the money a lot of the time, you know? But uh, I know for some of you who could really use the money, it's a big deal. But <laughs> don't make it, don't make your happiness. Basically, the lesson is don't make your happiness on a one in one trillion probability, is I guess what I was trying to say. So there you go. Side hustle, pimping ain't easy. Did I do it already? I think I should be at 100 now. Oh, I'm at 85. Okay, I got one more to do. Jesus, this takes forever. Yeah, as I throw all my money in the pot. <laughs> Oh, can I do this again? Jesus, you can do a lot of upgrades here. Is this a Game Genie thing that I didn't, can you do this for Game Genie maybe? Is get these, oh shoot. Just crossed out of my live stream. On the. I'm banking on the apocalypse. Should I do more guys? There's a learning curve to pimping, but it ain't easy in general. That's right, Papa Linus. That's right. Supposedly you could just keep doing this upgrade, but I'm almost out of money here, peeps. <laughs> Should we do one more upgrade on the arrows? I'm sorry, I like I like that name. It's a good name, right? It's like saying Hella or something like that. It's just good. Good times all the way around. All right, one more one more time here, and then we're done. I'm so happy. Look at how how much happiness I've purchased. I guess money can buy happiness. Throw a few fifty. All right, last one. I promise. Save my state so I don't have to do that again. What am I at? Bombs? Okay. Cool. So supposedly you can go up to 50 bombs and 70. So according to this walkthrough, you can get up to 50 bomb capacity and uh, you can get up to 70 arrows. Oh, there's some fairies here too. Let's go ahead and get those fairies to the right. Should we grab them? Nice. We caught a fairy, guys. Our lucky day. The bilinear filter on this game, does it make it look better? 
All right, what do we got here, peeps? Let's pause really quick. All right. Uh, just outside the pond of happiness, jump into the water and swim to the northeast. Follow the arrow, narrow water pathways up a screen to the left. So here we go, northeast. Let's, let's see where this takes us. Northeast. From north east. Ooh, there's a heart piece. How do I get in there? Narrow pathways. Okay, this looks more narrow. And to the left to reach a bridge. Swim towards it and Link will be taken to the area underneath the bridge. Okay, here we go. Speak to the camper found here and he will give you the third empty bottle. Cool. Look, there's homeless people. Speaking of, like, if you're almost homeless, just find, find a home underneath the bridge somewhere. Legend of game frequent free FAQs. The legend of game walkthroughs is really what it's up about. Swim back, right, and down a screen to return to Lake Hilia. Use a nearby staircase to the right to resurface back on land. Swim back, right, and down a screen. And then use a nearby staircase to the right to resurface on land. Okay. Okay. Then once you're on land, walk up a screen, left a screen, and up two screens. Okay. We got up a screen. Walk up a screen, left a screen. Jeez, get away from me. Jesus. Up a screen, left a screen. Then up two screens. Go on. Cross the bridge. Cross the bridge and then head up a screen. Okay. Along the left side. Walk up screen along the left side. Walk left a screen to the cemetery. Enter the actual cemetery. Oh, now I gotta go into a grave. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, here we go. Enter the cemetery, lift up the two small rocks that block the grave, then push the grave open, creating a secret hole. Fall down inside. This freaking bee's gonna get it. There we go. We're in, people. We're in. Oh, so there we go, guys. Remember, I was asking you guys about this earlier in the stream. This is going full circle. This is back to the original level, and now we can go in these bomb holes. To the next, I haven't, I haven't seen anything of the new season of Game of Thrones, have you? Is it, is it as dope as it's supposed to be? Are they leading up to the hype? Are you supposed to, is this supposed to be good? I mean, come on. Outside the sanctuary, head left one screen and up a screen. I gotta get out of here first, right? How the heck did I get out of here? Right. From outside, head left one screen and up one screen. Okay. What are we at here, people? What's what's the subscriber at here? 
control blade. I don't know if it's gonna happen, guys. Live subscriber count, where is it? I don't think it's gonna happen, guys. It's okay, though. Oh, shoot. We're actually pretty close. <laughs> Left a screen and up a screen. Wow, 12 away. <laughs> Left a screen and then up a screen, I think it said. Is this it here? Oh, we're only 10 away. It's getting real. Oh, mine only shows 10 away, but I don't know if that's... I think they're, like, hyping it up for me, you know? Sansa is full of tartar sauce. <laughs> Damn. Okay, I think I'm missing where I needed to go. I think it's here. Okay, I mean, it's not here. From outside the tree, head left one screen and up one screen. Near the top portion of the screen, Link can read a sign. Oh, there we go. I think this is the sign. <gasps> I, I want to... <laughs> I don't know if I think I want to read that sign. Just write a sign. You can lift up a large rock and enter a cave, which happens to be the entrance to the Death Mountain. Cool. Hop off the ledge and head right. Hop off the ledge and head right to the first turn. Take the south route. Okay, take the south route. Just to the right, Link will find the lost old man. Okay, that's a freaking dead end. There we go. I don't know who you are, but if you're going to go up the mountain, will you take me with you? I lost my lamp. Okay, so now we got the old dude. Avoid the pitfalls in the cave and walk to the far right side of the room. At the end of this path, the old man tells Link to turn right. Let's just go over here. I guess I'm supposed to go in here. Go to the far right. Watch your step. Okay. I said go to the far right of the room. Don't spoil Game of Thrones! Turn right here, you know, I have a granddaughter who is your age. The king took her to the castle. Yeah, true, it's all been written, man. All right, who we got? Here we go, here we go. After the, 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 the continue down this path to the exit cave, reaching Death Mountain. This area here is filled with dead rocks and falling boulders. A dead rock will turn into stone if Link swipes at it. With his sword, this becomes troublesome as they can block Link's pathways. After a few moments, they will come back alive and move around. Avoid the enemies and boulders and continue walking to the right. Once Link and the old man walk to the next cave, the old man will thank Link and give him the magic mirror. Okay, let's try to get this magic mirror. Oh, Jesus, there's so much happening here. After he goes in, I'm supposed to go to the right over here and go up the stairs, they're saying. Okay, go up the stairs. Okay, you'll find another cave. Ignore it. Walk to the right and then up where they can find a cave. Ignore it. Instead, walk all the way to the left and ignore the cave here and instead climb up the rather large staircase. Okay. Geez, that is a rather large, a rather large staircase. All right, now what's up? Walk up the left side, ignore the cave here, and said, right, okay. To the right of the large staircase, Link will find a cave that he can enter. Directly south of this cave, Link can see part of another cave that's along the cliff. Okay. Link will find a cave. Okay. I gotta do this one thing. Link can see part of another cave along the cliff. Okay. Directly set, Link can... To jump down here. All right, we'll 
What's up, chat? What's up, chat? I hope Jimmy pushes Bram. <laughs> okay, no spoilers, guys. Oh, dude, am I about to die? No way. Let's see what happens here. Oh, I have a fairy. Nice. Sweet. Thank God I have a fairy. Alright, now what do we do here, peeps? What are we doing in this room? What are we doing in this room? Okay. Oh, did I do, did I enter on the wrong cave, people? I think I may have gone on the wrong cave. I don't think I needed to do this one. I think I had to wait do a different one. Is that really a waste of time? I think I gotta go back. I think I need to go up the rather large staircase again. Ah, I see, it was a different one, okay. So there wasn't this one, it was there's another one over here you gotta jump down. Maybe? I'm a little confused. All right, this walkthrough isn't helping me out very much. Okay, ignore that. To the right of the large staircase, Link will find a cave that he can enter. Oh, there's two of them. Mm. Okay, I see where it is now. This is where I needed to go. Okay, cool. We're good now. Seven subs left? What? We're doing it. We're doing it, YouTube. Alright, cool. What's this? Alright, cool. So we're out of here. Let's see what's next. Okay, now we gotta go to the blue warp portal. Man, we gotta go to the dark world already? This is cray. See, I don't think I ever got this far in this game. This is new territory for me here. We're pioneering together. This is insanity. I'm glad I'm here for it. Going to the dark world, people. We're going. Oh, he's a bunny. Oh, we're doing some murder kill. F. <laughs> Twinsies. Repeat. Not. Oh, we're down to seven now, guys. Jesus. All right. To the right of the large staircase. Okay. Dark world. Once Link arrives in the dark world, he would change form, turning into a helpless rabbit or a bunny. Walk directly to the west and Link will find an area on the ground that has two distinct diamond shaped patterns. Stand on the one to the right and use the magic mirror. Okay, west, never eat shut. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the west. Diamond patterns, okay, I see it right here. Stand on the one on the, on the right and use the magic mirror, okay. Oh, I see it's gonna give me a pendant here. Got it. Nice. The 
What? Uh, can I go back in that? How come? Oh, maybe I pressed the wrong button. Is that what happened? Because I was like, I don't. Jump off the ledge to the left. Then jump off the ledge to the north. Oh, okay, my bad. Oh, I see what happened. There's a little. Oh, here's the next dungeon right here. We made it. Yes! So now we're in the Tower of Hera. Tower of Hera. Nice. Let's save this bad boy. Six, five to go. Mine says six. Mine says six to go. 9,994 subs. The three hour stream to get to 10K. See, this is what makes this game so great right here. It's like this little, this little detail of like how it works, how it doesn't work, and how you can throw an object to make it hit one thing. Like the puzzle process here is awesome. Awesome, awesome stuff. Thanks, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Mine shows six more still. 9,994 on my screen. All right, from the start of this dungeon, slash the crystal switch to lower the blue blocks. Blue blocks. Walk down the steps located to the left side of the room. There are a pair of Stalfos, as well as a mini Moldorm enemy found here. How's this guy not dead? Either hit the crystal ball to snatch it with the boomerang or walk and then walk back up the staircase. Great. Stand just north. That's easy. So I suppose you can get the dungeon map right here if you want it. Avoid the red that shoot fire at you and use a small key to unlock the locked door at the northwest part of the room. Okay. How are we at? Where are we at? We're at 9,096. Oh, jeez, these freaking tiles again. I think my strategy is going to be throw a freaking. Oh, what do I need to do here? There's a switch somewhere. Where's the switch? What do I need to do here? Am I... Am I doing something wrong? Three to go! 9,096. Um, there's a series of flying tiles and to break them with your sword as they fly until all of them have been relieved. Jesus. Two more? Is it two more? Mine says three more, guys. I don't know which one you guys are looking at. Mine still says three more, guys. Jesus, that was a lot of swiping. Mine still says 9,997. Oh, that's kind of cool. Where's my heart at here, peeps? Mine still says three to go. Oh, two to go now. Oh, they throw bones at you now. Nine thousand nine. I got two to go here on my guy on my side, guys. 
I might sell this too. Okay, one more, one more. <laughs> one more, one more, one more, one more. All right, we gotta save this. Here we go, here we go. Whew, this is worth better than the than the solar eclipse. Mine still says 9,999, guys. I'm still at 9,999. Did I? You guys, you guys are celebrating, I haven't seen it yet. <laughs> Mine still says 9,999. Come on, let's go 10K, 10K. Mine still says 9,999. Almost. Almost. 10,000. It rolled over. It did it. It did it. Yes. All right. We did it. We did it, fam. We did it. 10K. 10K. Woo. And one, uh, one over. So you guys, I think, are like one ahead. Oh, now I got one over. I see it now. 10,001. Yeah, where'd my bottles at? Whew. See, I wasn't prepared. I was thinking this was going to happen tomorrow or the next day. But it happened today with you guys. Love you guys. Thank you. This is sweet. Sweet stuff, guys. We did it. We did it. Mmm. Yes. A little water, champagne for champions. We did it. I don't think I can, I can, I can, I think this is the high point of the stream, guys. I don't think I, I have to, I don't think I can continue playing this. All right, let's, uh, so we saved a bunch of states. Let's get out of here. Whew. Woo! We did it. We did it. Man, thanks, 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 guys, for being part of it. Luke, negative one. Matt, a little pixel, thanks for your help in us achieving that last home stretch. Appreciate it. Retro Dunk Junkie, I'm glad you were in here. You and Liquor and Country Country Cleta should have been in here. Oh, is he in here? No. Level one online, thanks, dude. The Game Beaters. Paps was in here. <sighs> Luke, we did it, guys. We did it. Yeah, the. <laughs> I'll take donations if anyone wants to donate. <laughs> Woo! Nice. You know, you know, it's funny, like moments like this, you ask people like, you know, milestones like this and you never see it coming. You know, like I, ne I don't. Yeah, I don't know. Like, this is just a small, like to me, it's just keep making videos, right? Just keep going. But uh, give away $10,000. <laughs> But I appreciate, I mean, you all, you all helped me get to this point. So that, to me, is the most important thing out of all this. You know, the people that come into my videos regularly, they leave a comment, they like, they answer other people's comments. So cool. So cool. PayPal doesn't save my car. Dude, Chauncey and his sub bots. Chauncey, I appreciate it. I'm sure... I'm sure like a hundred of my subscribers are related to you somehow. And I still pr appreciate, <laughs> yeah, this chat. We need to get this chat on the, on the, uh, hey, how do we get out of it? There we go. Hyper pie. Since it's 10,000, I'm going to, I'm going to leave you guys on a little secret that there might be uh, the rumor is there might be a hyper pie too. That's the rumor. I don't know if that's true or not, but supposedly we might be having a Hyper Pie 2. So if you like the original Hyper Pie, get ready, because it's going to be legit. Hyper Pie with a little Hursty Blue on there. Good stuff. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Tasty. It's okay, guys. It's, you know, I don't. It's okay if you don't donate. I was just messing with you guys. When is the new Retro Pie coming out? They're always coming out, man. New updates, things like that. Always, always, always. All right, guys. Two hours, 40 minute stream. We made it to 10K. 
<laughs> did I did it go back down? <laughs> I'm at nine thousand ninety nine again. It's all right. It's all right if I don't have exactly ten k. We did it. All right. It says ten thousand one, so we're good. We're still good. We're still gooch. Now time to log out all these accounts. <laughs> Oh, God. All right, guys. Thank you again. Thank you, everyone. We did it. Awesome stuff. Um, some cool stuff coming out in the next couple of days. And uh, I hope you guys all got your... For those of you that want the mini NES Classic, I hope you got it. I know how... Like, I, I am mad at Nintendo thinking about how mad you are. How mad you are. That whole thing is just BS. So, I hope you guys get it all. I'm still above. I'm still on top for at least a few more hours. Oh, dang. Water cool fool. Thank you, man. That's a little cherry on top. I appreciate it. Water cool fool, $10 donation. Love it, man. Thank you very much. Nice water, dot, dot, dot. Yeah, maybe I'll have some wine after this. All right, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you, water cool, for that. Ramon Roman. Yes, the SNES Classic Mini. <laughs> yeah, that would be cool, but I doubt you're going to get one of those. They're going to be hard to get. All right, guys. 3-2-1 my destiny. He made it. Yeah. Nice. Thanks, dude. All right, guys. I'm going to take off. Um, thank you very much. See you on the next video. Don't forget to smash that like button on your way out. And... Uh, there's going to be lots more of this. So let's keep going. Keep the momentum going. All right. Have a good one. Have a good night. Sleep tight. Enjoy. And peace.